This morning in our series, Life Lessons, we are talking relationships with a couple that's been very open about their own. That's right. Uh, Kadeen and Deval Ellis have been together for 20 years, married for 12, and they've got four boys. Their web series, The Ellis's, has racked up millions of views. They also have an award-winning podcast as well, and somehow they found time to write a new book about, <laughs> about building a meaningful union. It's called We Over Me, the counterintuitive approach to getting everything you want from your relationship. Good, Good morning to both of you. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Thank you for we barely made it with all those boys. You know, I, I know. <laughs> Trust me. Happy to be here. I'm yeah. lucky. Every morning I get to work when I only have the three. Oh, my um, goodness. So... I the beginning of this book, you guys say this is not a how-to, and if you're not happy in a relationship, mm -hmm. you can always get out of it. Mm -hmm. Why did you want to start the book with that precedent? Well, we, we wanted to start with that to make it clear that it's about a choice. Mm -hmm. When you get into a relationship, the, the ability to have a choice to be here or not be here means that your partner wants to be here. So mm -hmm. every morning when I wake up and Kadeen is still here, I feel excited that she chose to be here. Yeah. Aw. He's not holding me hostage, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you don't have to blink three times. No, I don't. I don't, I don't. Um, you, one of the things you write about in the book is being of service mm -hmm. to your partner. Yes. What, what do you mean by that? That's so in important for us. So the counterintuitive approach, you know, you think of what people think about a relationship. You have a checklist of things that you want to gain from the relationship, right? Mm -hmm. But for us, we thought about what if the approach was being your whole self? And then what can you do to be of service to someone? How can mm -hmm. you help make their day better? So usually when I wake up in the morning, aside from being there by choice, mm -hmm. I say to Deval, like, how can I make your day better yeah. today? Wow. What can I do to alleviate something off of your plate? And in turn, I noticed when I did that, it gave him the say, you know, he was like, wow, she actually cares enough mm -hmm. to mm -hmm. ask. He's in a good place, so then mm -hmm. he can then treat me a lot better, right? Yeah. Yeah. You know, we're thinking yeah. about each other. It's about yeah. give and take. It's yeah. fun to have you on this morning. I started following you guys a long time ago because did you guys you? were so, yeah, you guys were so relatable. I have three kids of my own. There we you, seem go. To, you know what I mean? You seem to like each other. You're both really good parents. <laughs> what do you do when you're just cranky or you don't, you're not getting along? Like, yeah. you know you love each other, but you don't like each other at yeah. the moment. Well, we, we like to say that marriage is one long conversation. Okay. You mm -hmm. never stop talking. Yeah. So one thing I learned to do I never try to tell Kadeen how she's supposed to feel. Mm -hmm. If I say something that's made her cranky or she's cranky, I don't try to invalidate her feelings. Mm -hmm. I've learned to accept the fact that she feels a certain way, and then I go back to say, well, how can I help you get out of that? I mean, no one when to tag each other in and out, right? Because yeah. it's overwhelming at times, yeah. you know, with his acting career and me doing everything and the yeah. kids. It's like, sometimes I need some help. So mm -hmm. either send in the reinforcements yeah. or just go take a nap, because I know you <laughs> Right? Yes. That's a beautiful yeah. family. Yeah. Oh, oh, thank oh, you. Oh, Look oh, at the baby. And we have one right. more in the crew there, one more. Oh, so, so you guys are on social media, you know, Chanel watches you, mm -hmm. and folks see you on the social media, yet they may tend to maybe want to try to model what they see on your social media to themselves, and mm -hmm. you say, you've got to be you, you've got to be Absolutely. authentically you. Absolutely. Yeah, there's, there's no reason, the minute you start comparing yourself to another relationship, you're going to feel like you failed, because mm -hmm. nobody can be the best version of someone else, they're already doing that, yeah. even in their mistakes and their flaws. So one thing we always try to do is when people say, oh, you guys are couple goals, please do not label us couple goals. <laughs> yeah, we we are devouring Kadeen goals, and right, you got to yeah. be the best version of yourself. And we're really trying to figure it out every day, right? Ultimately, yeah. we yes. all have the answers, to but out. we're trying yeah. to figure it out, we're trying to survive with these boys and do it well, you know? So let's talk about the boys, because we yes. all have kids here, and kids are needy. They get in the way of a <laughs> yes. relationship. They, sure they just, do. like, demand so much of your time. Yeah. And you guys say... The kids don't have to come first. The relationship right. has to come first. And I think what you emulate as a, as a couple, yeah. your kids pick up on. Oh, oh absolutely. Sure. Yeah. I mean, and when you say the kids don't come first, people automatically run to Twitter and be like, oh, my gosh, if there's one piece of food left, he's going to give the food to his wife and not his kids. No, that's, the, that's not what we're saying. We're, we're all going to get a bite. Absolutely. Yeah. Okay. We're all, but, but mom is going to get a bite first. That's really how it works. Um, I tell her this all the time. This family doesn't work without her. She has to be okay. And as long as she's okay, the boys are okay. So I tell her, listen, you take care of me, and I'll take care of us. Mm -hmm. So the kids can't be first. Right. We got to take care of each and other. And as a mom, you know, I naturally, that my instinct is to put my children first. Sure. But when he and I aren't on the same page, nothing floats, you know? Yeah. So sometimes we have to take the time to disconnect a little bit so we can reconnect, mm -hmm. right? Have a date night. Oh, my goodness. Oh, yeah, time we do for date each other. Those are scheduled in all the time. All the time. <laughs> thank y'all. Thanks for being here. Yeah. Oh, no, oh, thank you guys. Yeah. We appreciate y'all. Watch y'all growing up, you know, always a Today Show fan. So, yeah. Oh, well, yeah. Now you're starting to feel old. I am. I am. Don't feel We know they just met you. Well. <laughs> <laughs> the book is called We Over Me, and it is available now. All right. Congrats.
Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.